my friends. Okay, with all this time at home, I've had a little bit of time to clean out closets, and I found this book. This was actually my book when I was a little girl, and I like to read it to my boys. It's a cute book, and it has a good message for us about staying safe. This book is called Never Talk to Strangers. Do you remember we talked about strangers? A stranger is anyone that you don't know. All right, here we go. And this book has some rhyming words. Let's check it out. If you are hanging from a trapeze and up sneaks a camel with bony knees, remember this message, if you please, never talk to strangers. If you are shopping in a store and a spotted leopard leaps through the door, don't ask him what he's shopping for. Never talk to strangers. If the doorbell rings and standing there is a grouchy, grumbling, grizzly bear, don't open the door. Mom won't care. Never talk to strangers. <clears throat> if you're waiting for a bus and behind you is a rhinoceros, though he may shove and make a fuss, never talk to strangers. Ooh, it's pushing, that's not nice. If you're mailing a letter to Aunt Lucille and you see a car with a whale at the wheel, stay away from him and his automobile. That's a car. Never talk to strangers. If you're riding your bike at noon, that means lunchtime, and you see a bee with a bass bassoon, this instrument, don't stop to ask him the name of his tune. Never talk to strangers. If you're swimming in a pool and a crocodile begins to drool, <laughs> paddle away and repeat this rule. Never talk to strangers. Oh, that would be so scary. But if your father introduces you to a roly-poly kangaroo, see, if your daddy knows um, someone and introduces you, then it's not a stranger. If your father introduces you to a roly-poly kangaroo, say politely, how do you do? That's not talking to strangers because your family knows her. If a pal of yours, a friend of yours you've always known, brings around a prancing roan, this colorful horse, Welcome him in a friendly tone. Say, hello, how are you? That's not talking to strangers because your friend, your pal, knows him. If while eating toast and honey, you catch a glimpse of the Easter bunny, tell him a joke, he'll think it's funny. That's not talking to strangers because everybody knows him. Now I'll tell you why you've never heard this jolly giraffe say a single word. It's because she learned from a little bird. Never talk to strangers. The end. It's a short book. I hope you liked it. It's very important to remember um, not to talk to someone that you don't know, even if they look nice, right? Um, we learned about that this year, staying safe and never talking to strangers. I hope you liked my big book, Never Talk to Strangers, by Irma Joyce. She's the author. And George Bucket did the pictures. I thought they were really beautiful pictures. Okay, good, good message. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Don't talk to strangers.